Hello you guys, I'm back in the state here. Just did the star looking shutdown of this phone, which will be uploaded after, before this one. Anyways, we're going to be doing the start up and shut down of the Kyocera Rise on Virgin Mobile. This is my first Kyocera in the collection, and it does have a sliding keyboard. I tested all the buttons up here, and they work perfectly fine. Did I do a start up and shut down of the Samsung Galaxy S Vibrant already? Mm, probably I have to check and see. But anyways, it's not it's not about that. Without further ado, let's get into the video. The heck is that for? That was so out of focus. Rise by Kia Sarah. Well, it looks like this phone has... Nope, the battery ain't dead, but it is low. Hang on, let me unlock it. Yep, see right there? Battery is getting low, 9% remaining. So I have to finish up this video because I don't know how long is this going to last. But here we will go to settings. Go on down here to about phone. And as you can see right there, this Kia Sera Rise runs the Android version 4.0.4 .4 Ice Cream Sandwich. Samsung Galaxy S2 Epic has the exact same software. Right there, and also the exact same animation as well. Of course, not upside down, but this side, this side, and obviously up here as well. Let's go ahead and boom. All the buttons on the keyboard work perfectly fine. I trust you, it is not that dim up here. It's, it's just a camera, but anyways. Keyboard works perfectly fine, as you saw there. Glows in blue and white. Got blue accent in some in some of the parts of the keyboard, and mostly white. Which is pretty cool. All the buttons work on it, as I said. But anyways, let's turn it off. And... Go from there. Alrighty. That was basically it. This was the startup and shutdown of the Kia Sera Rise C5155 on Virgin Mobile. Share the no no no. Share the video, like and subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss a new video. I upload whenever I can. We are at 372 subscribers, and I will see you guys in the next video. Seven two. 4-2. Out.